Welcome to Metal Heroes, where we celebrate the treasure trove of robot masters across the Mega Man franchise. Now sit back and eat your sprain rolls, because today is all about Dr. Wily number 53, Sprain Man. Sprain Man is an original creation of Dr. Wily's. A robot that likes going with the flow. That is, of course, unless we're talking about slinking down a flight of stairs. His unique build is comprised of thousands of sprains, making him lightweight and capable of long and high jumps, but also prone to smacking his head on the ceiling. It does, however, make him very elusive in combat situations. He's equipped with spike-tipped sprains, called Wild Coils, and if nothing else, has a mean right hook. You could say he'd make an excellent bouncer. Besides his weakness, which weapon has a special effect on Spring Man? Good luck, Mega Man. Brain Man's winning submission was submitted to the design contest by Akira Ito. Funny enough, Mega Man 6 saw a submission sporting the same name and gimmick. Like a sprain, I guess what goes around comes around. Mega Man 7, 1994. Sprain Man makes his debut, and in this game, he sprains into action by throwing out wild coils and tries punching from a distance. While he's in the center, he can be avoided by sliding, and his coils will always bounce in the same spot. However, Sprain Man tries to pounce on Mega Man. If caught, he'll bounce up and slam Mega Man into the ceiling. His greatest weakness is the Slash Claw. Mega Man Battle and Chase, 1997. Sprain Man makes his final appearance. As a playable racer, his ride is the Surprise Boxer, which of course has hydraulics and can punch other vehicles. Upon winning the Grand Prix mode, Sprain Man goes on a shopping spree and gets himself all wound up. The answer is the Thunderbolt. Right on! <laughs> With Sprain Man retracted, Coming up next time on Metal Heroes, there's going to be a rumble in the jungle. Oh, and don't forget your top hat, because we'll be exploring Slash Man. Until then, this is Denden, Den, signing off. <laughs>